arm bar from mount using a dummy. We go through four important steps in drilling this. The first is how to grab the arm. So this is you're gonna, something you're gonna wanna practice. You're always gonna wanna attack the arm that's on top, because the other one's gonna be defended by that one on top. Reaching down under it, palm down, slide through, grab the back of the tricep. There's the other arm on top, underneath, snake around, grab the back of the tricep. You can drill this on your dummy over and over. You don't even need to switch the arms, you just know you would be attacking the arm on top. But practicing that. This is the first mistake people often make is not knowing how to grab the arm and grabbing it the wrong way. So you're coming across, this arm's pointing this way, I come across with my opposing arm to grab from behind. That's step one. Step two is how to set up this turn, which you can do without a dummy to practice. Starting in your kneeling position, bring your arm across your body, imagine you're grabbing that tricep, and you're gonna load up and pull like you're opening a door. And you wanna end up this elbow resting on this thigh, this foot up, this knee down, and this hip pressing into the back of their shoulder. And I, I would be perpendicular to the dummy. So you can practice this, boom. And with your dummy, reach under, oh. and see, I'm resting my forearm against my thigh. Take very little effort to hold this arm in place. This hip is pressed into the shoulder so they can't get their shoulder back down to the ground and defend this. Step three, how to step over. If all your weight is loaded up on this leg, you're not gonna be able to step it over. You wanna load all of your weight onto that leg where the foot is on the ground. I'm leaning on that foot, leaning on my own thigh, so I have no weight on this leg and I can step it around. All the weight's leaning forward and a little bit backwards towards their hips. So you step my leg around, pinch to fall back and finish the arm bar. The other side. Hip against the back of the shoulder. I'm pressing on the head. Arms resting on my thigh. Bring that leg around, pinch, and step back. The fourth part of this drill a bit more advanced, but how to get back in the mount after you've stepped off of the arm bar, especially if you had a sloppy one and you didn't finish and they were able to pull their arm back out, they're gonna scramble and get on top. So I'd like for you to practice this windmilling approach to get back on top. Fall off, miss it. So to do that, You fall off on the side, you're going to crunch or curl your hips up because you're on the small part of your upper back. You're then going to rotate so you're parallel with the dummy or with your opponent. You're going to take the near leg straight, circle it down, the top leg straight, beat it over, and you step up on top. The other side, rock up, parallel, circle down, sit over. So, grab, step over, finish, windmill, come up, other arm, come off, windmill back up. Practice that, dummy is a great tool for doing this. You can do it over and over and over and your dummy doesn't get tired of you sitting on their chest and ripping their arms off, you'll get tired, but you'll get better at it. Give it a shot. Let me know if you have any questions. Thanks, guys.